when you're out there in Houston, you're doing the rescues, you go to a fire department and then they send you to another place and you get stationed. Uh, we showed up at Horn Elementary, which was a station that was shipping out evacuees to different shelters. And from there, we went and launched our boat into uh, SciFair. When you're looking at it on social media, it looks like it's easy to get around and it really isn't. It took us five hours just to clear out that one subdivision. And I, you're talking about maybe, maybe six, seven, uh, six, seven blocks. We went in and at 12 o'clock, the water was at our knees. By the time we left around four o'clock, it was already up here. It was high, the water was high. We helped uh, rescue her out of her home with a dog and uh, she was breaking down and she kissed her, her dad goodbye and he refused to leave the house and he had just had a stroke a couple months ago and he didn't have really the strength to be traveling everywhere. So she's crying, she has a bag of dog food, a small backpack and this rescue dog that's so scared, he's shivering and everything. Not sure if he's scared enough to where he's gonna bite you, but he's, he, he's terrified and driving her out on the boat and her crying and then telling you if you could possibly go back and try your best to convince him to leave, get him to leave. I think that's the one that we personally dealt with that stuck with us the most.